for 72 is 72. On the regular season, the Roadrunners in the San Jose Barracuda. We are off and rolling. Here's he big Leonard Camper with a blast. Now thrown in by Leonard in front. They score. He big on the doorstep. And the Roadrunners, 24 seconds into the first period, take a 1 0 lead. So, first shift of the game, Tucson strikes first just by getting pucks to the net and bodies in front. And a fa last year, puck comes back out along the wall. So second best winning percentage in team history is Onyabuchi, he'll push it up the near side. San Jose comes in, a shot, they rip it home and tie us up at one. Mitchell Russell getting his first. And we're level 431 into this first period. After the Roadrunners got that first goal of the contest, 24 seconds in. Here looking for win number seven to wrap up the regular season. Dilibatory has it knocked down as it's picked up by the Barracuda. Here's a shot they score. And the Barracuda score four on four to take a 2-1 lead with 8-10 gone by in the first period. So after that early one by the Red Runners, San Jose's come back with two straight. And they've got the lead. They led 1-0 last night after reset. Here's Nathan Todd. Leaves it in the circle. Knocked down by Reese Vitelli. Soderstrom. As it's knocked away by San Jose. Many numbers here and they score. As it goes right to Philip Bistat. He makes it 3-1 with 434 left to go in the second. Roadrunner is just a kind of a giveaway there, and all of a sudden San Jose a two on one at close range, and the Barracuda up by two with 434 left to go here in the second. Three goals in a stretch of three minutes and 27 seconds to take the game as the Barracuda tie it up right off of the faceoff, and it's 4 4 with 12 19 left to go here in the third. So Mason Klee is going to get it, and now the Roadrunners are going to need a fifth goal for a second straight to two in the third. Put up four goals in a period for the seventh time this year. And scored on four of their final five shots in the 5-1 win, breaking the one-all tie. Here comes Kellerman. He scores! Milos! 105 into the third period. Picks up his 16th. Tucson is back with it a goal well that was a great start for the Roadrunners getting rolling here in this third period McCartney with Hebig and Leonard and then the Roadrunners coming back with Milos Kelvin walking into that right wing inside Soderstrom drops for Tyson crosses the blue left wing circle Kellerman in front, Tyson, he scores! Colin Tyson from Milos Kellerman forks up for Colin and we're tied at three with 4.06. Got by in the third. So the Roadrunners are racing that two goal deficit in the first 4.06 of the frame, striking on the power play. What a pass from Milos. And led 1-0 for 4 minutes and 7 seconds. Loose puck in the neutral zone. Hunter Drew trying to get it back out for Kellerman. Barron in front. Travis, shot, score! And the Red Runners take a 4-3 lead. Travis Barron on the goal there for Tucson. And Kellerman going to pick up his third point to start this third period of play and the Red Runners lead up 4-3, two goals, 26 seconds apart. Colin Tyson and then Travis Barron and it is 4-3 Red Runners. Behind the cage, still has it. In the circle, leaves for Dilibatori who walks. Peter spins back out in front of the blue line. Leaves it now for Ben McCartney. Benny a toe drag shot, blocked. And Dilavatori trying to pick it up. Tristan Robbins comes back. Breakaway for San Jose. He scores. 
and the Barracuda win it in overtime, five to four. And so now the Roadrunners gonna be watching 